Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Challenge. I'm your host, Alice Parles. Back in the last episode, we got started on our adventure, and we caught a Poochiana. And Pig Trico is our starter. Which, this Poochiana is very low level. Route 102. Let me check to make sure that we haven't been on 102 already. Uh, that's 103, and I think down here is 101. Yes, so 102 is open for encounters. That's cool. Uh, but if I'm correct, a certain Pokemon can appear here, so I'm going to try to avoid getting an encounter until I know for sure that things are going to be okay. Okay. Oh, he's raising his attack. That's not good. Tackle. I did jack diddly squat. Okay, switch metal in. He's still just howling. Okay, suit yourself, dude. Pound. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ouch. Numb. Ah. Gosh, golly darn, that tackle stings a little bit, dude. That thing stings. But it's okay. It's okay. Doggo grew to level 3. Very nice. Alright, defeated our first trainer. Oh, goody, a bug trainer. Great. I think he's only going to have a worm pull, though, so I don't have that much to worry about. Unless it knows a poisoning move. But catcher Rick, is Morty with you? You heard your mom. We have adventures to go on, Morty. One more before I switch you out. Yeah. Now we're in the risky getting crit and getting O code territory here, so. Yeah, no thanks. Stupid thing. Die! Freaking worm pulls, man. Metal is now level 8, which is good. Switch into another worm pull here. Uh, just to try to get Doggo some more levels. Because <laughs> Doggo is so close to level 4. He's like almost on par with these Wormples. <laughs> a potion, so if I desperately feel like I'm going... Oh, you're just using String Shot. Okay. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Ice Machine going off. All kinds of noise. With my grandmother in the living room. Not the living room. <laughs> the living room, not the kitchen. Yes, we have a refrigerator in the living room. I mean, well, I personally got a mini fridge in my room. So, I guess to be in all technicality, you can't have a fridge anywhere in the house. Okay, I think it is healing time. My Pokemon need the heals. Because, holy crap, dude. But hey, at least Doggo is getting some levels, which is good. Which is which is good. Doggo needs the levels. Alright, no, no, stop, stop. <laughs> I did not mean to speak to you again. And also, this time I remembered to uh, actually uh, set my select button to something. It, oh, crap. Well, here's my encounter. What do I get? A worm pull. Okay. You know, whatever. You know. Totally wasn't something else I wanted in this area. You're slower than a worm pull after one string shot, dude. Seriously, dude? Seriously? 
Okay, I have a feeling this one only knows string shot or something, because it is only done string shot. Unless you're just trying to make me so slow. Do you just enjoy covering doggo in your white fluids? Because that's, uh, that's a little gross. Balka ball go. Two, three, catch. Well, I guess this makes up for the wormhole that I lost last video. Great. Wonderful. Yeah, I'll name it. Better idea. I was gonna name it Wormy. Better idea, I'll name it. Wait, I have select thing. I can literally just... Oof, oof. Ah, that's much faster. Oh, oops, crap. Ma. This is my bug. Don't even, don't even, man. Don't even mess with my bug. At least it is technically on par with the rest of my team. A gentle nature with shield dust, which I think is a decent ability. No, you had you had tackle. You were just not using it for whatever reason. A uh, gentle nature. Let it me check. I might as well just keep this book like just open to the page that I need. Uh, gentle, gentle, gentle. Lose defense, gain special defense. I don't really know how that is for a bug or for specifically wormhole um but you know i kind of have to accept it so <laughs> i love you for who you are my bug love you for who you are it's still a bummer though because there was a specific pokemon i was wanting and i think everybody knows but even then, the chance of actually running into it was slim, so I guess I can't get too upset. Runaway is going to be a very nifty ability. <laughs> Did you just become a trainer? We're both beginners. Oh, are we? Great. It's so nice to have a fellow newbie. Youngster Alan, what are you going to send? Oh man, you got that zig zig? Go doggo. Alright. You are slower than a zigzagoon. I... I guess I should not say I'm surprised. Other than the fact that you just had your attack lowered. Uh, let's send out Metal to take care of this Ziggy. The Ziggity Zig 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 Zag. I just pound it. You know, I know technically... Well, now you're just lowering my physical attack, which means now I'm going to use my special attack. Which, I get a boost from that anyway, so it doesn't really matter, because my ability strengthens grass moves. But, uh, no, I think that's in, if I'm in, like, yellow or red health. Never mind. It doesn't just do it generally. Right. Talo. Now, this is going to be a bit of a problem if it already has a flying-type move, which hopefully it doesn't. You know, this is going to be a chat for me, though. I've never actually tried to raise a worm pool before, so... This should be fun. Please don't. Wait, you're level 3. You, yeah, you're. I highly doubt you're going to already have the moves that I know you can have. Nope, never mind. Ouch. I did 7. I think... Well, if you're just going to keep using Growl, you're only going to do 7. Just that 7 damage? Really? And I critical hit you, which... In all honesty, it was a little unnecessary, man. That was that was a bit overkill there, Metal. Like, come on, dude. It, it, it was just a Talo. Let's go heal. <laughs> I'm going to be going to the Pokemon Centers a lot. I I know there's, like, a certain rule that you can put on towards, like, you only visit a Pokemon Center once per town. But, um, screw that. <laughs> no thanks. Oh my lord. I am so terrified of at least one gym later on. So far, in my mind, that I'm thinking of at least one. Elite four might not be the best thing either. That might be a bit of a jerk. But oh well. You! Fight me. 
Have you further your career? Silly woman, you're going to further mine. Last Tiana with a ziggy zag. Sweetie swag, what's in the bag? Hmm? An episode of an. Uh, you. Oh my. Doggo. Doggo. Ugh. But that episode of Ending Eddie was so stupid. <laughs> Swiggity swag, what's in the bag? I promise that's just not me trying to sound stupid. That's the, the, just quoting Ending quoting Eddie. It's okay. Stop growling at me. You're not threatening. You're simply a raccoon creature thing. Really? You tackle me one time to do nothing but growl? What are you, scared of me? Sheesh. Doggo grew level 5. And he learned Howl. Which I guess is okay. And hey, Metal grew level 9. I just ended a shroomish. I wish my bug knew a bug type move besides string shot. Because that would be really helpful right now. Tackle it. Let's just see how much damage you do. That shouldn't do much, because that's grass. And I am bug. You cannot hard harm me with that crap. Although, I'm not exactly doing the most damage to you, either. Mm. But it is a sacrifice I'm willing to take, because I am not... Uh, actually, okay, now you're using tackle. Good. Uh. Crap. Oh, crap. Oh, my lord. No! No! Oh, this is going... This is going so smoothly. Oh, my gosh. She would have been... She would have been fine. Going for that poison. Freaking poison, man. We're only, we are only in episode two, and I've already lost something. That is not a good omen. Then again, it was something I didn't really want in the first place. If you, if, you know, wait, where am I going? There's a thing down here. Really? Jump into the grass. And there's a worm pull. <laughs> Quit taunting me! I know my bug is dead. Stop it. Oh, and then there's a potion. I just have to add insult to injury. And I'm gonna run into some. Oh my lord. Lotad. It's a Lotad. Too bad I can't catch you. Lol. And are you. Eh, I guess I'll fight you. Why do all of these things know growl? I'll just use howl. That's right. Okay, okay, okay. Screw that. <laughs> I I can see already where that battle was going, and it was not going to good places. Huh. <sighs> All right. To the PC. Oh, I forgot to mute Discord. Whoops. I did not mean to do that. Go to. Pokemon. Party. Well, my bug. I barely knew ya. But see you later. Bye. Bye bye, my bug. Well, so much for trying to raise a worm pole. <laughs> oh, man. That's a bummer, man. Not a bomber, man, but a bummer, man. Uh, that reminds me of a video I saw a long time ago where, like, some guy kept saying bummer, man, instead of bomber, man. It was bummer, man. I don't even have that much money. I should probably... I'll hold off on buying stuff. I'm not exactly hurting for Pokeballs or anything. Going to the gym. Hello, Dad. I really don't care with what you have to say. 
I will now tap the button I have set to A on my keyboard. And Wally is actually going to catch the Pokemon I was hardly able to catch. But you know, this game was cruel. He's going to be catching a Ralts. Hey, at least this run I didn't run into to the uncatchable shiny pooch and the uncatchable shiny Ralts that disappears. So, I guess that will actually the, the pooch would be a sapphire thing, right? Oh gosh. Oh. Can the shiny Ralts thing even happen in Emerald still? I don't actually know, but I'm assuming probably. Eh, just catch the Ralts. I remember one time I played a randomizer of this, and the Pokemon Wall ended up catching was, I think, a Mew. He threw a Pokeball at it and it broke out, but it still counted as him breaking it because he's supposed to catch the Pokemon. Two, three, catch. You know, if that Ralts was just like a level or so higher, he would have been screwed because he would have only had one turn to catch that thing before it used Teleport to get away. Yeah, yeah, he caught the Pokemon. And don't, by the way, guys, let's, let's not tell Dad that I, oh wait, I'm saying it right in front of him. That's probably not a good idea. Come on. Crap. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up, thank you. Let's not tell Dad I'm doing a Nuzlocke run. I've already killed a Pokemon. Shh. He doesn't need to know. Oh, hello, Scott. <laughs> yeah, to be honest, dude, I'm not a great trainer. I mean, I lost a Pokemon already. I suck. Yo, fight me. I don't remember what you use. Is it like a C dot or something? I don't remember. Another ziggy zig 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 zag zig zig zag 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 goon. What is with all of these Pokemon that are able to growl? Like, why is that a thing? At least that one used Tail Whip that time. And now it's just back to growling. Growling and Tail Whipping, that's apparently all, good that, all the goods that Zigzagoons can do. <laughs> good lord, this Zigzagoon kinda sucks. It is doing nothing but growling at me using Tail Whip. Like, I understand technically what he's doing. He's weakening me up for the next Pokemon in line. I know what he's technically doing. But you should have got some damage in yourself there, Brosif. Oh well. But since I remembered there being a C Dot. I just don't remember where there was going to be a C Dot, but this guy does have a C Dot. Hello, C Dot. And now that I have been. Oh, Lord. Whew. Mm. Since I had been. Uh. My defenses weak. Oh, my Lord. Is this really happening right now? Uh. Oh, now you're just using Bide? Oops. Energy, clear. Lower that defense some boy. Just energy. That's gonna hurt. Eh, it wasn't that bad. Let's lower that defense back down. You're using bide? I'll just keep using leer. Screw you. Bide one more time. Not by but Leer. Since by can go through to this turn. At least energy. You're not gonna have anything to unleash, so it's gonna fail. Pound. Growth. That looks raises your attack. Yeah, your special attack. That doesn't matter. I like you're gonna get to do anything with it anyway. 
Doggo, go to level 6. Very nice. Defeated Youngster Billy. Alright, cool. This guy. Has a magical quality to it, huh? Fisherman Darren. This better be a high percentage magic card, dude. I'm telling you. If you're making me fight anything that is not a high percentage magic card, we're gonna have a problem. Like, this thing better splash, like, right off the bat. Good. It is a high percentage magic card. That I'm going to. Uh, wow, it's actually faster than me. <laughs> I think that's a little sad. Sheesh. Eh, at least I'm gonna get my heels off of this thing. That's really sad that I am slower than the magic card. If I'm correct, this counts as a. I'm technically on a new route, am I? I think so. Up. Oh, easy there, emulator. It's okay. Everything's fine. Hmm. Just to be absolutely sure that I'm on a different route. Battleberg. 104. I've been on 102. Yeah, this is a new one. Let's see what I get. Oh. Okay. I'll take a Meryl. I like Meryl. Azumarill's bulky. Yes, please, do defense curl. Make it harder for me to actually kill you. Yes. Yes. Do just that. Please do. Hmm. Darn it, how do you think of a good name for a Meryl? Hello, bag. Pokeball, go. One shake, two shake, three shake. Cool. Caught the Meryl. The Aqua Mouse Pokemon. Cool. Sure, I'll give it a nickname to it. Hmm. Nickname for Meryl. Uh, well, there's only one name that I think fits. This thing's name will forever be Pika Blue. Sounds fair enough to me. Let's take a look at Pika Blue, shall we? Huge power. No. Naive nature. Naive. Lower special defense raises speed. I don't exactly know how that is for a Meryl, but oh well. The huge power thing is going to help. I like how this thing only used defense curl, but it also has tackle. Like, what is with Pokemon I run into and only using one move when they have the option to use another one? I will never understand that. Hello, you. Eh, sure, we uh, we can battle. I know what you're going to have. You're going to have that stupid Zigzagoon. That you're going to waste a full restore on. Because you're stupid. Got a Pokemon. Bring Metal out. Of course you're going to growl at me. Why wouldn't you? There's the tail whip. There's the growl. Screw it, using absorb. Because at this point it'll probably do more damage. Go on, hit me. No, you're just dead set on tail whipping. Good to know. Good to know. See, you, you brought this on yourself. You brought this on yourself. Hey, Metal's level 10 now, though. That's always a plus. Having a Pokemon level up. 
anyway, guys, I think that's going to be all the time I have for this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Challenge. I'll see you all next time when we head off to the cave. Not the cave, but the forest. The Petalburg Woods? I think that's what they're called. Yeah. Until then, guys. See you later.